out of Muxlow, reading for Frank. Out of order. I'll show you out of order. You don't know what out of order is, Mr. Trask. I'd show you, but I'm too old, I'm too tired, and I'm too fucking blind. If I were the man I was five years ago, I'd take a flamethrower to this place. Out of order. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? I've been around, you know. There was a time I could see. And I've seen boys like these, younger than these. Their arms ripped out, their legs ripped off. But there's nothing like the sight of an amputated spirit. There's no prosthetic for that. You think you're merely sending these foot soldiers back home to Oregon with his tail between his legs? But I say you're executing his soul. And why? But he's not a bared man. Bared man, you're hurt this boy. You're going to be bared bums, the lot of you. And Harry, Jimmy, Trent. Wherever you are out there, fuck you too. I'm not finished. Now as I came in here, I heard those words cradled of leadership. Well, when the bow breaks, the cradle will fall. And it has fallen here. It has fallen. Makers of men, creators of leaders. Be careful what kind of leaders you're producing here. I don't know if Charlie's silence here today is right or wrong. I'm not judge or jury, but I can tell you this. He won't sell anybody out to buy his future. And that's my friend. It's called integrity. That's called courage. Now that's the stuff leaders are made out of. Now I've come to a crossroads in my life. I always knew where the right path was, without exception. I knew, but I never took it. You know why? It was too damn hard. Now here's Charlie. He's come to the crossroads. He has chosen a path. It's the right path. It's a path made of principle that leads to character. Let him continue on his journey. You hold this boy's future in your hands, committee. It's a valuable future. Believe me. Don't destroy. Protect it. Embrace it. It's going to make you proud one day. I promise you.